everyone and welcome to another video. It is time for another scent of the week. Apologize for the mess. I'm still kind of searching through some or sorting through some things. I still haven't actually fully got back into the swing of things. I've uh, been suffering from jet lag and had a lot of work to catch up on so it uh, should be interesting. Um, so I just wanted to touch upon some scents that I've been wearing uh, for, the, for the past week. In particular, I mean we had uh, Halloween yesterday and the day before so I went to some parties and uh, chose some scents for that. So during the week, actually, I was still hooked a little bit on this little boy right here, Green Irish Tweed. I was wearing that, I was still kind of in the Ireland swing of things, and so I wore that to work for most of the week. Did absolutely fantastic. One time I got mistaked uh, for wearing cool waters though. So not surprising, but this little bad boy did it for me. Uh, now on Friday, I actually decided to, or I went to a party and at that party it was basically just a close gathering of friends and by party I mean like a small party I'm talking about like eight people we all know each other so it's not anything huge or anything like that so um, I went with um, Ombre Nui uh, from Christian Dior it served its service pretty well I didn't get any compliments I knew all these people they all know I always smell good um, and you know it's kind of like a foregone conclusion so unless I really wow them or drop them down um, or I mean come out with something that they just haven't smelled before at all they're not really going to give me any compliments and I really wasn't expecting any with this one uh, so Armour Nui is what I wore now yesterday Saturday during the day I actually wore this sucker right here I was pulled it back more on animal on animal we we're just doing some simple stuff Becky and I we were doing some pumpkin carving um, and you know just cleaning up around and getting ready for the night so it served its purpose pretty well but then you know went got ready for going out and when I went out I actually decided to wear um, this little bad boy Mascara Jour. I brought this sucker out to wear it did absolutely fantastic I actually did get two compliments on this sucker here um, and at the same time one negative compliment somebody didn't like uh, what I was wearing for it and this is muscle of Major, this is what I'm expecting out of this bad boy. Now, I was actually in costume when I was wearing this one. I was actually Godzilla, and Becky was a bride. Hence, together we were Bridezilla. Um, so that's kind of like the scenario, but we went uh, we went to a friend's uh, party at first, like a pre-party from, I think it was like 6 to around 11, and then we went to a party that was in um, an abandoned church, and we, uh, it's like, you know, it was like kind of like a, a dance party basically like a rave almost and I wouldn't say rave just because it wasn't all techno music but you get what I mean it was just a lot of dancing a lot of drinking stuff like that and that lasted till about two and we for decided we're getting old we forgoed going to another after party afterwards and we just went home um, right afterwards so that's kind of what I was wearing and this lasted throughout the entire night for that and with it again two compliments and one negative uh, a negative compliment if you will all right uh, so that's pretty much it. Let me know what you guys were wearing. I'm curious to see what you guys were actually wearing uh, for Halloween if you decided to celebrate that and what scent you wore with it. I mean, I, I chose Moscow Vachor because I just figured it was out there. This is Godzilla. We're out there. That's kind of the scent that I envisioned. Uh, Godzilla scent, if you will. And that's pretty much it. All right. So let me know what you guys wore uh, or what even you think Godzilla would like, would wear, if you will. All right. So that's it. Thanks guys, take care of yourselves and you guys have a great week.